Here's how you export a video from your DaVinci Resolve timeline into a WebM file. First things first, I have both good news and bad news. The bad news is that as of now, you can't export WebM videos straight out of Resolve. The good news is that there's a free tool you can use to make it happen, and it's available on Windows, Mac, and Linux. Go ahead and export a master file out of Resolve. You'll want to keep it high quality since we'll be compressing it down to WebM in a minute, so the less compression, the better. I use QuickTime ProRes for my master exports. There's also an uncompressed option, and if you're on a Windows computer, you can use DNxHD. Once you have your settings dialed, hit Render All and let Resolve finish your export. Next, you're going to download Handbrake. This is a free, open-source video converter that you can use to convert files into different formats, including WebM. I'll include the download link in the video description. Install Handbrake, launch it, and open the master video you just exported from Resolve. Change the format to WebM and adjust the settings to your liking. I usually don't change anything except bitrate, which helps you to compress the video to a smaller file size. What's enough highly depends on the content, but since I'm using a CG loop here, I can turn it down quite a bit. If you want to find the best balance between file size and image quality, I recommend doing a couple of test exports to see how low you can set your bitrate before the image quality starts to look bad. Then, start your export and let it rip. Once you're done, you can preview your file either by opening it in Google Chrome or using VLC Media Player. And there you have it, your video from Resolve has been converted to WebM. If this helped you out, I have one favor to ask, and it's the zero cost ways to support our channel. Share the video with your network, subscribe to our channel, and drop us a comment below to say hi. These are small things, but help us tremendously to continue to create content like this for our audience. Thanks for watching. See you next time.